my first time in, in an Oval Office set um, was... <laughs> Mama was like, I loved Freeway. <laughs> <laughs> was, no, they, they were shooting Nixon, and Oliver Stone produced Freeway. And I didn't want to do it, and so I had turned it down. But I really wanted to do an Oliver Stone movie as a director. Uh, so he said, I'd like to meet with you. And, and so I walked into the, the set, and he was sitting behind the desk at the Oval Office. <laughs> and he made me sit down like he was the president, and I was like some lackey. And I sat down, and he said, why don't you want to do the movie? And I listed off four or five reasons. And he said, those are so obvious. Come on, why do you really not want to do the movie? And I said, no, that, that's pretty much it. And he said, I don't know what, if you can say this, but he said, you don't... You say whatever you want. You don't, have, you don't have the balls to do this. And I was like, yeah, I do. I just don't want to. And he's like, no, you don't. You don't. And I said, no, I do. I just don't want to. And by the time I left, I was doing the movie. So I was, <laughs> I was kind of a, a, a sucker for that. Reese is amazing in that film. Uh, She's never done a performance like that. I've, I mean, she does done incredible well, performances, but and that. Matthew Bright, who wrote it, uh, the dialogue was just extraordinary. I've never seen a gutter mouth like the character that she got to play. <laughs> and I got to play a guy who, who smoked through his throat. I mean, it was just so bizarre. What is that great line where you come into the courtroom and she looks at you and says, look who got beat with the ugly stick. stick yeah. And you've literally smelled like a hole in your throat Bro and a jaw thing on. Yeah, with a halo around my head in a wheelchair. It was just so bizarre. And, and I remember when it first uh, was seen at Sundance, HBO made the movie and bought the movie and it was gonna be for them. And it had such a successful run on HBO that it finally then got released in theaters. It was completely inverted. And when it was first shown at Sundance, it offended so many people that Oliver Stone went, something's good about this movie. So it was, so th those were the people that we were dealing with. 